are about to announce the Australian Exporter of the Year and you are all in the running for it. And we'll be inviting you all up on stage at the end for a big class photo, a group photo. Right now, let's give all the finalists and tonight's category winners a massive round of applause. <laughs> to do the honours for this evening, and announce the 2022 Australian Exporter of the Year. Would you welcome back to the stage, Minister Farrell. Before I hand over to you to announce the winner, let's take a moment to recap all of the winners from this evening. 2GR Wagyu B. Bubs Australia. Stanley College. ABI Interiors. My Venue. Next Level Racing. Little Green Farmer Red Arc Electronics Five Cast Medical Rescue Morton Co Coulon Green Eco Technologies Rubicon Water That is an amazing group of finalists. Congratulations to them all. If you are the winner of this, we ask come to the stage, get a photo uh, with the Minister before acknowledging the win. Minister, that diversity is incredible, isn't it, of the winners tonight? Uh, look, you may not have uh, influenced uh, the outcome, uh, Kochi, um, but neither did I. They won it <laughs> on their own merit. But the winner tonight of the Australian Exporter of the Year 2022 is Bubs Australia. Thank you. <laughs> <laughs> Thanks, everyone. I'm really, uh, really excited. Thank you very much. Thanks, Koshi. Well done, Christy. Um, something like this. What does it do for Bubs Australia? Um, I think, first of all, um, the, uh, our teams have worked uh, across three time zones. Um, so uh, this is uh, an incredible testament. Uh, yep. to all the hard work that our teams have done. Um, as an example, within 24 hours of receiving the FDA US government call for help, um, our team put together a 270-page uh, document, including all the process flows, all the quality testing, um, and uh, we could not have done that without um, the reliability of uh, Australian agriculture uh, um, understanding, uh, you know, having full transparency of uh, manufacturing 
and, uh, and we're able to do all of that uh, in our own very factory um, with, um, you know, some uh, blown up mattresses and, uh, and everyone in their jammies and, uh, you know, the, the emergency shower sort of uh, came to use, but um, uh, our team didn't quite have the shampoo and uh, conditioner, so we were actually having a shower with hand soap. <laughs> um, but uh, uh, look, you know, they were all just uh, wonderful memories. And, uh, mm. Because for those people who don't know, um, um, America's biggest infant formula manufacturer had a contamination issue. So it was withdrawn from market. So, you know, there was sort of panic within sort of not only just mums, but political circles uh, in the United States. Joe Biden got involved, sort of thank buds for coming to the... I, you went and met him, didn't you, I think? Did you yeah, meet did. Joe Biden? He looked sort of Real? across things. <laughs> yeah, okay, all right, good, just asking. Um, Sometimes he looks a bit sleepy, but anyhow. Um, but you, that was an opening, a once in a lifetime opening for the business, wasn't it? it yes. Was, yeah, good. No, absolutely, it was um, uh, the first time that uh, uh, infant formula industry opened up in the US um, mm. in probably 50 years and um, we were there and we were prepared to catch it. So, uh, And how important was the Australian brand in terms of safety and um, uh, sort of the higher standard? Did yeah. that play a big role? All of it, uh, all of it. it, it uh, um, I think, uh, uh, you know, the, uh, the government uh, has been absolutely critical um, in, you know, knowing that uh, there is this wonderful friendship between Australia and the US. Yep. Um, the, uh, the, the US um, uh, FDA together with, um, I guess, uh, DOOR, DAF, uh, here in Australia, um, uh, given that there's reciprocal recognition of some of the standards, um, it made all of our jobs a lot easier. Um, so it's, the clean and green goes so much further in, uh, uh, and it goes all the way back to the farm. And we're very, very proud. Um, of um, all the work that everyone has done. Incredible achievement tonight. Congratulations. <laughs>